For those of you just joining in, I'm Gary Thorne along with John Cruck and Steve Phillips. We bring you Major League Baseball here on 2K Sports. Caramona's pitch swung on and missed. 0-1. Goes inside with the sinker to try to tie up the hitter. Now let's see if he goes back away. Ball. Fastball misses low that time. 1-1. Now the 1-1 pitch. Fastball gets away from him there. 2-1. Ball. The pitch. That ball is belted deep to left center field. Ball is on its way. Gone! A home run. And they get the first run of the ball game. That solo shot, that is a big fly ball. 1-0. Well, in the lead now, Gary, the Tigers' offense getting the job done. Now they want to see if they can't continue a rally and keep on tacking runs, get that margin for error for the pitching staff. There's a swing, a ball hit well deep into right center field. Out of here, a home run. They'll take that one run homer. They need that. Now the lead is two. Here's the Central Division race as it stands going into the dog days of summer. Brought to you by State Farm. Tigers in first place. In second place, it's the Indians. Third place, the White Sox. Twins are fourth. And it's the Royals in last place. That one swung on its line. And that's going to be another hit for them. What more do you need to see? Now you have to question his confidence, giving up three straight hits. Not much going right out there at this point. And we've got Bosch batting. Runner on first base, nobody out. And the first pitch. Pitch out. Nothing was on, though. Here's the, oh, and Jackson's going to run. Right one. He is safe at second base. He made up his mind he was going to go for second base. He had a huge lead off, maybe three or four strikes. That throw uh, just didn't get there. It was too late. Right one one pitch, a fastball, cut on, missed, one and two. The pitch from Carmona. Hard slider misses two and two. Now two strikes on him. They're probably going to throw him the slider here. He struggles with it. Here's a spin and a throw back to second. Sinker misses and it's full three and two. And when he can keep that thing down and away, it's nearly impossible to hit. Swung on, hit well, out there to deep, left center field, back at the wall, bounces up against the wall. And Jackson crosses the plate. And the Detroit Tigers, wow, what a momentum swing for them. Well, they need a big out right here, Gary. I mean, they're giving up some runs in this inning. They need to get outs right now, just again, to show that they can get them. And Ordonia settles in. First pitch. Let's that breaking ball go outside for ball one. In 21 ABs this season, two hits off the Indians. On the outside corner, one and one. That's it foul by Ordonia's. One two pitch coming. Oh my, that one came inside and plucked him. That'll bring Miguel Cabrera up. Oh, Gary, that hit batter we just saw. Now two runners on base. A little rally starting here, and maybe the pitcher getting a little bit rattled. 
And he starts Cabrera out. Foul! Cabrera will foul that one away. Now you watch and see how the hitters react to it. Are they looking for that next pitch down the middle, or they think maybe they got to wait him out? And the pitcher has to regroup. He's got to settle down out there, not panic, to get back in the strike zone. Out recorded by Santana. One away. Here's a look at the leaderboard brought to you by State Farm and the race for the batting champion. Well, when you watch these two guys hit, they have a lot of similarities, not just with their swings, but also with their approach and the way they prepare for a game. You know that they've watched tape on all these pitchers. They know exactly what they want to throw in certain situations, and that's what makes them so valuable. They don't take an at-bat for granted. They grind out every single one. And a moment to check out uh, what Cleveland has coming up. This Detroit series wraps up tonight. And after that, they'll be home against the Twins. They have to deal with Joe Maurer and the rest of that lineup. That should be a great series. They really match up well. That's Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Then they'll be off to take on the White Sox and that big bat of Carlos Quinton. That series bound to be competitive. Here's the pitch. Peralta fouls off another. On the way. And he fouls another one off. This one swung on and driven hard. And the sides retired as they head into the dugout. Pretty good third inning. They break things open with a few across. Detroit leads it three to nothing. It's going to be Laporta now. And Verlander has him all in one with that called strike. Well, the hitter didn't like that one, but that's a strike. He hit the inside corner up in the zone. Got to swing the bat. Line drive. He stops at first. It will be a single. Well, finally, they get a hit here in the third inning, their first hit of the game. But let's see if they can do something with it. Their number two spot at the plate. That one misses. It gets away from the catcher. So they can't make the play. Who cares? To make the error right there, you just don't want to do that. It's just not good baseball. This one's bounced ever so slowly to left foul. Swung on, hit in the air to right center. And it is in there. That's going to bring the tying run to the plate. And the run gets in. And the throw. And safe at second. No problem. Get to take a look at one here that probably should have ended at first base. Well, he had the burners on coming out of the batter's box and rounding first base. Great aggressiveness on his part. He didn't let up, and he gets in safely. No indecision when he got the first base. That's how you get in safely to second. And Brantley's in the box. Well, Steve, they've got plenty of time in this ball game, and what you got to do is peck away at that lead, and they are. Well, with the bats like we just saw, you know they're gaining some confidence right now, cutting the deficit and getting themselves a little bit closer. Let's see if they can take the lead. 0-1, Verlander kicks and deals. This is in the air, straight away left. Peralta to field this one. That's one away. And coming up for the Tigers... Tonight's game, the last against Cleveland. They'll continue their road trip for the next series. The Orioles at Oriole Park. That'll be a three-game series. Following that, a division rivalry. They'll face the Twins. That's a team they handled all right the last time up. They'll try for a repeat performance. That tag, and he is out at third. Oh, 1 Verlander kicks and deals. Slider locked him up. He's behind 0-2. Well, he's in trouble right here, Gary, and he knows it. He knows he gets a little overly aggressive on the 0-2 pitch. Let's see how good a pitch they give him. The 1-2 on its way. Curveball, that tied him up in knots. Swung on and missed. Side retired. 
Justin Verlander coming off the mound. One run scores in the third, the first one he has allowed thus far. 